Hi out there, White is out here, and I want to do two trailer reactions. They're teaser trailers, but still interested to check them out. Uh, the first one is Alien Romulus, and the second one is Beetlejuice Beetlejuice. We're going to start off with Alien first. I'm interested to see this. I want to, I've heard it's pretty much going to be more to the roots of the original, and even though I love Aliens, it's awesome, um, I do prefer the original. I still think it holds up as a great suspenseful sci-fi horror movie. This one is directed by Fide Alvarez. He, uh... The oh shit. Alien Romulus is directed by Fide Alvarez and he did the Evil Dead remake, which is probably one of my favorite remakes. He also did The Girl in the Spider's Web and Don't Breathe, and those are solid movies too. Uh, all three have really great atmosphere, so I think he's a perfect choice. Hopefully, um, I don't give away too much, and it's only a minute, so that's good. All right, now here we go three, two, one. We're in space. Fide Alvarez. Just that. Come on, help me, please. No, 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 hate to have, stop right there, but um, I just have to say, I already like the fact that they're going with atmosphere for this trailer. It's not flashing a bunch of imagery. Hey, remember this? Remember that? It's just we're hearing this two guy and a girl freaking out, saying, you know, freaking out. So I'm liking this so far, and it looks like Alien. Run. Awesome. <laughs> that looks like it's going to be, that looks like an alien movie. First of all, it feels like an alien film and they just had the look down tremendously. It looked just like something out of Alien. So happy about that. Obviously we got a new Sigourney Weaver, which is fine by me, you know, um, hopefully she can pull it off, uh, but you never know. Maybe they'll pull the rug out and pull like a psycho and kill off a character we think is going to be the hero and it really isn't. But anyway, um, Looks good. Gonna be checking that one out. Oh, my, my prediction? It's gonna be a hit. <laughs> I think this is gonna be a hit easily. This is gonna be one of the big ones, I think, of the uh, summer. Uh, if I'm wrong, then goddamn, that, that would suck. But I think this is gonna be a hit, for sure. All right, now we're getting to the next one. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. The long-awaited sequel to the original Beetlejuice. <laughs> God, I, I don't know, it's probably repeating, like, is every movie your favorite movie? And yeah, this this for a time was, like, my favorite movie. I used to watch it all the time. I love Beetlejuice. Winona Ryder's great in it. Also, Catherine O'Hara's great in it. Of course, Michael Keaton is the star of that fucking movie. I'm happy that it's Tim Burton doing it. It's not like, uh, well, let's pass the torch. Like, no, I want to see Tim Burton do this. And, you know, I know a lot of people have been giving shit to Tim Burton lately, and you, know, you should leave Tim Burton alone, okay? We are in his debt. He showed great courage in San Francisco. Oh, no. <laughs> That's Jack Burton. Jack Burton. You're protecting Jack you Burton. You leave Jack Burton alone. Tim Burton. Man. <laughs> Man, did the quality just kind of like... And the movie stars Jenna Ortega, and we also have Winona Ryder coming back as Lydia, and Catherine O'Hare as Delia. All right, so let's do this. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, in three, two, one. <laughs> I fucking knew it. I'm like, they kill his ass off. I, I thought they would do it in a, oh, your dad died 10 years ago, you know, of a heart attack. No, he straight up 
Jeffrey Jones is dead. <laughs> like, he just died. Oh, uh, man, that's, that's fucking funny. That's fucking funny. I wonder if Alec Baldwin will show up since, you know, he's got a case going on. Do you think uh, the uh, photographer of that Rust movie will make an appearance? Oh, fuck. Oh, that's that's not right. That's not right. Let's go. I would love a little model of the town too. I would love that fucking model somewhere. That'd be so cool. Like, that'd be a lot of fun to have. I just had to throw that out there. I tap that. The juice is loose. Well, looks like a Tim Burton movie at least. Um, hopefully it's good. Uh, I, I, I don't know, you know. <laughs> just I just hate to say it, but I, Michael Keaton's, you know, Beetlejuice is so fun because he's got so much energy. Oh, rah, rah. If he has that, that's great. But older, like, is it going to feel the same? Is it going to feel like, eh, this doesn't feel quite right. And so I'm guessing he's going to try to get Lydia back as his bride and sees the daughter and like oh, i'm gonna go for the daughter now so i i just don't know and I've, i just noticed without jeffrey jones there and i also noticed without jeffrey jones there it just makes beetlejuice the one guy in the movie versus three women so i have a feeling there's going to be a little bit of a feminist you know uh, message in here which is fine that works just don't overdo it let it be subtle you don't have to make it so blunt you know <laughs> anyway it looks okay i'm sure it will be good um, at least good. Hopefully it doesn't suck, man. That would be so disappointing. Like, dude, Burton, please. Not Beetlejuice, you know what I mean? Uh, what's next in Edward Scissorhands 2? Oh, no. <laughs>